Hey, what's going on guys? I wanted to uh, do a quick little product review on this uh, tactical development pro ledge that I have here on my CR920 XP. Um, it's not tightened up right now. So let me take this off. I'm going to show you um, exactly what this is. I've been getting tons of comments on this, on, on what this piece is and what it does. So basically it's, it's made by tactical development. You go on their website, this piece mounts onto your TLR7 sub. Uh, I'm pretty sure they have it for different different light setups, but this is made specifically for the Glock 43X, the Glock 48 MOS, and it will work absolutely on the CR920 XP. This is a thumb rest, okay? So what you're gonna do is, um, there's a, a, another a small key on this side of the light. You're gonna remove these two screws on the side, you remove this center uh, locking screw, you'll pull all that out. This thumb ledge, it's 3D printed, it'll slide right into there. You'll put your screws back in, put your uh, locking screw in, and you're done. That's basically the the install on it. Um, I don't think you need a video to, to show you how to do that. It's pretty self-explanatory. And then you grab your pistol, you mount your light to the bottom of the pistol, you tighten up your tightening screw, and boom, done. This has changed the way I shoot. Um, this is probably my third or fourth pistol with a, with a uh, thumb rest or some kind of gas pedal on there. Um, this one, they call it the Pro Ledge. It's made out of uh, plastic or, po oh, it's, it's plastic actually, it's 3D printed. Um, the texture here is, is is okay it's not overly textured and and my my thumb doesn't slip off so what you do is you'll you grab your grab your pistol and where you're going to put your su uh, uh, support hand you're going to put your thumb on that rest right there so um yeah i mean it's pretty self-explanatory i'll tell you i'm not a great shooter and this thumb ledge puts me on target every time if i take this off I'm still doing a phenomenal job. The pistol's doing most of the work, but this just helps mitigate that recoil even further um, of having that compensated uh, slide on the CR920 XP. Yeah, this is a great setup. I mean, if you guys are thinking about getting one, you know, I, I, I get it about price cost. This, the pistol's almost a thousand dollars. Then you got, you know, two or 300 bucks in the red dot. And then, you know, you've got your TLR7 sub. These are expensive pieces. I. I understand, go slow, buy your pistol, or put it on layaway, pay that off, get your red dot, go step by step. Plus the process is fun, right? You know, you get to grab your pistol and it's all bare. You shoot that, see how that feels. And then you throw your light on with your, you know, with your very inexpensive um, thumb rest for 40 bucks. If you already have a light, great. You know, I already had the light already. I've used this light on several Glock models um, that I've gotten rid of, and now I'm on to the CR920 XP. This this setup has been phenomenal. Um, yeah, if you guys want to know anything else, put some comments down below, see if you guys like this, and if you want me to make more videos on this or, or shooting videos of it, I will. Thanks, guys.